Hello and welcome back to Meadow Grove Farm. Today is Sunday the 10th of March. We have had a phone call from the stables and they are short of straw. We have got a surplus. So to get a bit of money in we are going to take a load over to them strap them as we go so we don't knock them off and we will get some straw taken over to the stables, sort them out need to get just a little tight around the back here but it's all good so we will get the Draw over to the stables. And that will help them out a little. As you see, we've got plenty of straw in the shed. We're coming to the end of when the ground and everything is frozen so the cattle still need bedding so we need a little bit of straw but not a lot um, always good to have a surplus to sell they all just gone and got Hooked into the bell pull. Don't know why. There we go. We will now strap those two on. Hopefully, get nearly as much as we need for paying the. April loan, we paid the repayment for March, so I haven't got to worry about that, but also now we're getting some milk each day, not a huge amount of milk but we are getting some which is great gives us a 200 pound every day to oh, that's, there we go. we may need some straw again at some point but for now we will get one load taken over we're soon going to be busy the ground temperature has risen to minus one which means that very shortly we will be able to get on the land, get some work done, get some barley and oats in the ground. I'm not going to bother with rye because there's no no sell point for rye. more bales on the back we 
and then put a row on top of those. I'm going with a double row, we will try and get them with a single row across the top of there. And so we've still got six bales in the back there that's enough for us for the rest of the time well more than enough for what we need if we have six bales left even if we have five bales left is more than enough we do need to get some more well we're not going to buy any more cattle we're getting the the young each year so they in turn will breed as well may have to buy a bit more a before the onset of winter uh, spring and we can get some a cut again we will put this bale in the middle that should drop into that gap nicely there it goes tractor. Yeah, two more bales <coughs> on that, then we can head over to the stables and use their John Deere loader tractor. To unload these. We will now get that down there, that's lovely. And one more bale. Should be able to get this last bale on without strapping the previous one. We are out of A, that's this next year we should have enough A, but the problem we had was all those bales disappearing on us last year, which okay, it. probably should have strapped it first, that will get that on there. We will put this back in the shed. Push that up there. Head over to the stables. That is a load ready to go. Make sure. Fair road trek over to the stables, so still not going to be very late when we finish, but then it's Sunday, so we don't want to be too late getting finished. I did want to be finished and back home for midday, but that's not going to happen with the dairy ringing up there. Uh, stables ringing up asking for some straw. Now away we go with our 65.
The field doesn't seem as flooded today. One thing I wanted to check, I just wanted to check whether there's an outlet for the rye. Which there doesn't appear to be, so yeah, I'm not, not sure why you can't sell rye. Probably an oversight by Nathan, but we have got some and we can take it over. Not sure whether you can feed it to pigs or cows or anything. We may try and put it in one of the little tippers. Trek down here to the stables. All these new crops on here that you can grow and no outlet for them is. Uh, may actually load the lorry up and let it take them to Sandy Bay. <coughs> Still a long trek down to the stables from here. Sort of got to go past them and then come back to them as you get down here. That's our new farmyard, a couple of fields to the left that we own. There is the stables in front of us now. But we have to go past these houses every year if we've got any surplus straw at the end of the year and any surplus hay as soon as we start to make the new A, we will sell off any surplus. Stables always more than willing to buy A and straw. And also sometimes silage, but I think that for now we don't make silage. down here and this is coming down now to another right hand turn where we go back to the building we passed a few minutes ago bit of a twisty lane here down through this road now Ground temp air temperature has gone up to four, but still got a minus one on the ground temperature. Here is the stables now coming into view. This gate just knows ourselves onto this track. 
And jumper bodies. New John Deere. Load. Yeah, that's lovely. That's all the straps off. And here is his John Deere that he's got. Bad track to this actually, it seems alright. Two bales sold, we are getting three hundred pound a bale, so two thousand pounds for our half a day's work. We did think about buying a tractor like this when we got the Renault, but the Renault got a good deal on it. So we went Renault, not John Deere on the farm. I think it would have been a good replacement for our 65 to be fair got that little bit better turning circle a lot, it's only done 0 0.1 of an hour, that's how new this John Deere is for them. this side and then we shall head back over to the farm maybe head to the shop as well and pick up a couple of three a bales right. There's a good tractor for the stables goes pretty quick in reverse pretty quick forward speeds
Yeah, I think if we get another four A bales, it should see us through to A making season. And getting these bales sold gives us a bit of money to put towards the two A bales. least that will keep the stables happy for a few days. I think they stable up anybody's horses. I don't think they've got any of their own. And they must charge a fair bit to have horses here. Price are giving us for this straw, so put that down. There we go. Put the tractor back away. And there she is, old John Deere. Happily working away on that. Right, we need to now spin ourselves around on this grass. Close their gate for them and head up back to the shop. That's coming away we go. <coughs> but as we head to the shop to buy some hay for our cattle. That is where we're going to leave you for today. Please give us a like, give us a share, drop us a comment if you're new to the Summer Farm Estates channel and you'd like to see more of the work we do here, please subscribe to the channel. Give that bell a ring, it will tell you when we do our farming when we do our racing until you join us next time thank you very much for taking the time to watch us and goodbye for now